guys, Mick with Busaroo here. Uh, just a quick tip, we're uh, putting engine bay radiators into this 73 bay bus. And uh, this little tip is rad for any bus. So what happens when you put your radiators, uh, they'll sit right here, right there, and right there. What happens, you can't reach the backs of these guys or the backs of the radiators in case stuff gets in there. Well, the way that VW has it is they have these funky little screws, captive nuts that sits right, sit right there and you have to access the back in order to uh, undo them. So we press these out, awesome press here, <laughs> just use a C-clamp. Put some nut certs in here, and then a washer and a screw, and you can access everything in you know a couple minutes. Okay, captive fasteners are pressed out with the C clamp. Now here's the riv tool gun, and we have an 822 thread uh, bolt and riv nut, and just gonna throw that on here. This is the hole we're going into. That one's already been done. We'll slide the gun on. Gun's on and you just pull the trigger. Unscrew it. Put the bezel on and put your bolt through and tighten it down. All right, so two are in, two to go. But that's it, that's basically the principle. So now you can access the other side of where your radiators will be and all the connections on the back side of this in case one goes bad, you can scuff it up and repair it really easily. It's a good update for uh, any bus, whether you have engine bay radiators or not.